So we have the box open just to kind of give um, an idea of what's going on. Um, all my makeup is like way over two years old and this is basically stuff for my birthday. So yeah. So first we have the mini sponge of Real Technique. Um, I wanted to, these to get under my eyes. I'm also using those little powder angle triangle ones as well to just kind of see which one works, which one doesn't. If you guys want a review on one versus the other, let me know. Okay. In the other videos I did, I did swatches. I don't know that I'm necessarily going to do swatches with these. Um, here is a flower CBD uh, corrector. Um, yeah, just uh, a product that I saw somebody else talk about. So I saw. I thought to pick it up. Here is the Milani cream to powder foundation. I've had this before um, and like I said, it's expired. So I needed to re-up. Some of these are also um, recommended. A lot of these are actually recommended by a TikToker. I'll put her name right here because right now with all the lack of sleep I got, I'm completely forgetting where my brain is. So if you hear a lot of ums and stuttering, that's why I'm just brainless right now. Okay, this is the NYX Wonder Stick. Um, yeah, it's for contouring, highlighting, all that fun stuff. You just hear them going off. Okay, then we also have Melania, sorry, the Milani uh, Seal Perfection. Uh, two-in-one foundation in medium beige and the concealer in a light beige um this is usually about where my skin tone is if not like a little bit lighter but I always have to end up getting like a medium beige or whatever and I never think that I'm this dark whenever I put it on I am this dark I just have really like olive skin and I forget that I'm a Native American woman and I forget, like, I look light-skinned, but I actually look darker skin than I, oh, something busted open. Um, oh, this wasn't put on tight all the way. That's really unfortunate. Anyway, so here's the Dewey Finish NYX. I've used this before. I got the smaller version this time. Um, yeah. Melania. Sorry, Milani. <laughs> Make it last dewy finish setting spray. Okay, and then we got what I see everybody's bread and butter being is the No Pore Zone and the e.l.f. Uh, Power Grip Primer. I have used this primer before. Amazing guaranteed I know this is going to be good. I have not tried this one um, so I'm looking forward to trying it out. Like I said before if you guys want me to review any of these I will. Um, here's another wonder stick. I got two different shades um, to kind of see what works better for me. So this is a highlighter um, from I Love Revolution. Let's open this bad boy up really quick. You guys can take a gander. I've heard from people that, oh Jesus, I'm struggling. Um, 
But this is as good as other highlighters. Oh, I want to try it out. It's really beautiful. I have seen other brands have similar designs. Um, not necessarily, I don't remember if it's the heart, but I do remember seeing like similar patterns with, um, what is it, Physique's Clinique or not Clinique? For, Physician's Formula, that's what it is, Physician's Formula. Um, I used to use them all the time when I was probably 18, 20 or something like that. And this one is a glowing prime primer serum. Uh, I don't know where I heard about this from, but I really wanted to give it a try. So that should be great. It's really pretty though. All right, and here, this is definitely something that I was recommended, and I had to had to get. It. I'm going to open it. Um, you never put this on without some type of water or something. Don't put it on bare. That's what I was told, and that's what I'm going to stick to. Oh, here's the Holy Hydration Kit. I got this smaller kit just so I can try it out. If it works, then I'm going to continue using it. If not, then no harm, no foul. Um, I got these two combinations um, because I always do a darker uh, lip liner. Um, I'll just show you what this looks like. So we're not going to swatch this one, but I do want to swatch this one real quick. Oh, look at how pretty that is. Oh yeah, that'll do. That's dark enough. It's hard. This is one I heard tried and true, always comes through, and I'm here for it. Um, I'm trying to stick to more drugstore type stuff, but I heard that this is unbeatable, and you can't go wrong with this one, so I decided to splurge for that. And then these are two that I really just wanted on my own. Nobody recommended these to me, but I thought that they were so beautiful when I had seen them in Target. I was like, I have to get these. They're too beautiful to pass up. They make a lot of like aesthetically pleasing. Oh my God, can I even open it? Hello. Okay, sorry, I had to delete memory off of my phone. Um, so here's the blush. I don't want to ruin it, but it's very creamy. And then I'll show you the highlighter. It's beautiful, champagne. Uh, 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 uh. Don't mind my son, he wants to be included. He thinks they're very pretty too, huh Ash? Think they're pretty? really pretty I like it obviously with a brush out it'll be better but I love the way that these look they're very very beautiful I mean they're nice to just have just to admire you know what I mean so I'm put these back in there no he doesn't know what we mean he doesn't know what you and I are talking about but yeah if you guys want to see um a review um an all day wear, whatever. Just let me know in the comments down below. Ashley, we are trying to be cute. And um, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye.